Hey everybody, what's up? Uh, so it's kind of early here and I am an idiot. I recorded all of this video thinking that my camera was on, but just the mic was on. So the rest of this video is going to just be pretty pictures over the audio. Promise you, you're not missing much. Just my face, which you know. Let's talk about the book, $100 Million Offers by Alex Formosi. I saw this going around social media. I saw everybody was talking about it. People were loving it. I was like, okay, here we go. This is going to be another one of those books that has an insane title that does not follow through. Somebody who maybe did that much money in revenue and not profit, and they're just taking Russell Brunson's stuff and regurgitating it. We've all seen it in the Make Money Online space. And to be honest with you, I've become very cynical. I'm not proud of it. I've been really, really cynical. So when I see stuff like that, I get immediately like, oh, here we go. But I saw so many good reviews of it. I needed something to read. I haven't been reading as much this year as I did in years past because everything just seems the same. All the business books that I'm reading are just kind of the same thing, but then full of fluff, right? It's the same concepts over and over and over and over and over. And when I saw this one, I'm thinking, here we go. This is going to be another fluff where he's just going to say, raise your prices, which is real talk. One of the most toxic things going around in the make money online community Raising your prices is fine, but the way that people are going about it is just raise your prices at all costs. It doesn't matter. They don't ask questions like, is your product actually good? Are people really getting results? Is the price really the problem or is it the offer? So I was just expecting that, right? So I start reading the book. It's about nine o'clock and I, I get the book on, on Kindle. And I'm sitting there reading, my wife fell asleep. So I'm just reading the book and boom, right into a story, which is typical. To write a good book, you kind of have to start with a story, but it just kind of irks me because I just want business tips. I don't need a story. I've heard so many stories, but it was a pretty good story. Uh, so next thing you know, I'm on like page 15 or something. And I'm, I'm, I'm kind of hooked now. So I, I'm, I'm committed to the book and I'm reading because I want to see what he has to say. All right. So I keep reading a little bit and he just kind of starts dropping really quickly these knowledge bombs. I'm like, oh, God damn it. That's right. That's, that's, that's pretty awesome. That's, he said it also in a pretty unique way. Hormozy is, is unique in a way. At first I thought it was just like toxically unique where he does this thing called like Hormozy time where he wakes up at 4.30 in the morning, which I've always said is so crazy and dumb until I kind of realized his lifestyle and that 4.30 in the morning actually seems... Like he's sleeping in compared to how much shit he does. <laughs> but anyway, so I'm, I'm expecting, you know, the book to, to, to be a bunch of fluff. And it's just a couple of knowledge bombs. And I don't want to like spoil the book. Uh, I've done a, a blog post over on my main site, entreresource.com, that kind of summarizes what I think are the core points of the book. But it's like really, really good. And, and something unique about Hormozy is that he actually makes his money with businesses. Unlike a lot of people in the make money online space who just make money telling people how to make money online. And he just absolutely crushes it with his gems. And then he also invests in other businesses. So I'm immediately intrigued and he just keeps dropping knowledge bombs. So it's like I'm on page 30 or something. And then he posts something about, Hey, did you know that if you have the audio book uh, and you listen to it while you're listening to Kindle, it's, you know, way easier to, to actually learn stuff. I'm like, God damn it. He's right. That is true. Uh, I'm going to get the audio book. So I bought the ebook, the real ebook, not the Kindle Unlimited version, because I wanted to keep it. I don't want to return it. And I'm like, this is good enough to keep. And then I got the audio book. I'm like, I'm going to listen to them both at the same time. So now it's like 11 o'clock and I've got the uh, AirPods on and, I, and I'm just plowing through this book. My eyes are like big. I was tired when I first started reading it, but I just kind of like re amped, re energized. I just read and read and read through this book. I was up till probably two in the morning, just going through all the content. And it was just next level. The stuff that he talks about, it's not as simple as just raise your prices. He actually goes through and shares things like raise your prices in a way that everyone wins, in a way that your customer would love to pay you that. He doesn't do toxic stuff like just charge as much as you can and then let the chips fall where they may. He actually goes so far as saying charge whatever you can as long as you can actually deliver that. And then deliver it and make the payment kind of contingent on that. So a lot of his offers are like, yeah, I'm going to take your top line revenue. It's going to be a ton of money, but you're going to make more. And it's in a way that it's, not, it's hard to explain until you read the book. 
but it is genius. It, it, it made me, it changed the way that I looked at raising your prices. It was the most genuine customer centric way that I could think of to, to raise your prices and without sacrificing the customer and without sacrificing the value that you're getting. Unbelievable. So next thing you know, I'm purchasing the paperback and, uh, and then I even bought the hard copy because I wanted to have the hard copy with like my top 10 books, all, all of my top, top books. I always buy the hard copy so I can keep them front and center. So the book, as much as I was ready to absolutely hate it and destroy it and roast it, that was mostly just my ego, I guess, because I wanted to accept that like, there's no way this guy who's actually like a year younger than me, I think, uh, is doing this. And even if just 1% of what he says is true, he's doing really well. Like he is absolutely crushing it on a level that most of us uh, can only dream of. So I really can't recommend this book any more highly. I'm not an affiliate for him. I've never met Alex. He seems like a cool guy. Uh, but yeah, this, this book is, yeah, absolutely. It gets my three thumbs up. Go check it out, guys. $100 million offers by Alex Hormozzi. Uh, if you're in the internet marketing space, internet entrepreneurship space, you probably don't need to hear that from me. But if you were like me and you were skeptical, don't be skeptical. Go read it. Actually, whatever you're reading now, go stop reading it and go read that book. It's actually refreshing and pretty original. Farting on the haters. I'd ask you to subscribe here, but this time I'm just going to ask you to not unsubscribe, please.